Hey everyone, Nick here and welcome back to GamerTube. So in today's video, we're going to be playing an in-development fan game for Little Nightmares. And this game is called Stories of the Deep. So it's made on the Dreams engine and it was made by Tiger Vegas, aka Dragon Guy. Now I've only seen a little bit of the gameplay, but I haven't actually played it for myself yet. But it looks really awesome and it looks like they've done a really cool job. Now this game isn't ready for everyone else to play, it's only per request. So we're really thankful that they actually gave us the opportunity to play this game. Also, down in the comment section below, Dragon Guy will be leaving a pinned comment explaining a little bit more about the game and giving you a link to his Discord server. They've also sent us a little description to read out for the game. So the game is set on the moor before the time of the Lady and Six. The demo you play takes place in a massive storage unit on the moor, guarded by the watchful eye of the Roma. So I'm really excited to play this game, and before I do, if you could please consider leaving a like and commenting as it helps out a lot, that's greatly appreciated. And also subscribe to GamerTube so you don't miss out on any of our future uploads. Alrighty, let's get into the stories of the deep. Okay, that's cool. So we're on the we're on the on the meat hooks. This looks really good. Oop. Oh no. Okay. This looks really awesome. Okay, I can control now. Oh, I seem to be injured. Alrighty. Let's see. Ooh. I've got a vent here. Duck. What else have we got? Oh, working flashlight. Oh my god, that's really cool. Damn. All right, that works out well. Um, what else have we got? Uh, so flashlight off. Jump. And grab. So pretty much like the controls of Little Nightmares. So let's see. Um, can we? Before we go into that vent, I want to see if we can go in any doors. I really want to explore this this place. This is really cool. Okay. No. All right, well, let's go in that vent. Oh, and we can run. All right, that's cool. That's handy. The vents look really well done. Even the sound of the metal. Awesome. Okay. Even the, the animation. I'm, I'm really digging the animation. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm really impressed. This is really cool. Okay, so let's explore. Climb up areas. Obviously, we've got to go upstairs. Go through this door. Oh. Oh no, oh no, do I have to hide? I think that might be the Roma. Okay. Oh, there he is. It's creepy. I like this. I like this. Okay. Go through here. Oh, no. Oh, he's stretchy. <laughs> That's creepy as hell. That's cool. Okay. He's got like long arms or like a stretchy torso. All right. Let's see if I can engage with this switch. And the controls are good. I I suck. Uh, here we go. All right, lights are on. All right, let's get back out into the main hall. 
Also, they said there was a lot of secret rooms and stuff to, to figure out. So I might miss some. So forgive me for that, but... We'll have a search around and see if any, any little Easter eggs or any secret rooms we can find as well. So... Back out here. Aha, power's on. Alrighty. So it looks like I need two lights to turn on. So let's go through this door. Oop, door shut again. Sounds like something's in here with me. Alrighty. What what's going on? Yeah. Oh wow. So it's just like it's his like torso or like he's like body. That's so creepy. That looks really cool and really creepy. Okay. Hearing footsteps. I'm not liking it. Oh, I better hide. I think this is the right thing to do, right? I'm gonna hide. Is he anywhere close to me? Nope. Okay. God, the amount of rooms and like detail, it's really, really good. Oh. Okay, cool. I thought I got trapped I thought I got trapped in like a cage. Okay, so... Alright, gotta walk the plank. Nice and slowly. Oh no, oh no. Oh, the sound they make is awesome. That's so creepy. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, we made it, we made it. Whew, we made it. Okay. God, that torch is really awesome as well. I like keep forgetting to use it. Okay. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Hey, Mr. Roma. Oh, yeah, I really like his design. Okay. Up, oh, down we go. What's he up to? Where's he going? Okay, so I can exit out of this. Yep. And I want to get up to that vent there. Okay. Cool. So through this crack in the door. Guess we go down here. Oh. Alrighty. So. What are we doing next? Oh. Oh, so he's like a viewer, kind of. Like, he acts like the viewer. He's like, like watching the TV frequency. That's all. Weird. Okay. Very cool. So I'll put that switch on. Oh, we've got a locked door. Alright. So there's a key to be found as well. Um, let me see. 
I might have to drag something over here, maybe? I can't go through here, but can I push this? Can't grab this, nope. Can I push it? No, okay. Oh, I wonder if he reacts if I get close. I don't, know, I don't want to mess with it. It's really awesome, okay. See if I can. <gasps> nearly, nearly. Okay. Oh no. Oh, oh god. Oh wow. Oh wow. <laughs> Probably one of the best AIs I've seen in a Dreams game so far as well. So. Kudos. That is. What is he doing? Did he put a key in that drawer? Or did he just check the. He's checking. He's okay. Oh wow! Oh 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 no! Oh no! Oh no! No! That's cool. Okay. So you can get you can get uh, you can get captured by the Roma. Okay. Okay. So let's try this again. Now we want to throw the switch. Oop. Come on. Alright, let's quickly hide. Alrighty. Now, I think he's, he's checking for things. He's checking. He didn't put something in that drawer. Oh, the heartbeats. Okay. Um... That's it, check over there, check over there. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh, Roma, okay. Okay, he can get me, even if I go into another room. Oh, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty, pretty challenging. So... So, oh, I can't see my screen now. Okay, he's. I think I should. I should be good. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay, let's make a break for it. I don't know if running will alert him. Okay. We got the key. We got the key. Oh, cool! She holds the key as well. That's awesome. Uh oh. All right, Mr. Roma, just just sneaking past the key. Almost home free. We're almost there. Ooh. Oh, I thought he got me. I thought he almost got me. Okay. Let's make a break for it. Alrighty, how do we use the key? Ah, cool. Alrighty. Um. 
Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, the noises are so cool. Oh, cool. All right. I'm going for here. Thank you, Doki. And I know I'm saying cool a lot in this gameplay, but like it's it, it there's there's no other way to describe it but cool. It's really really cool. Okay. Oh, I hate I hate walking on things. I'm so bad at this. Okay. There we go. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Come on. To the vent. To the vent. Okay. We good. Okay. Hey, thank you for playing. Dragon Guy. This was really, really awesome. Fantastic work, Dragon Guy. I actually really enjoyed this. This was very close to Little Nightmares gameplay. Like, very impressive. Alrighty everyone, so that was the gameplay for Stories of the Deep. Um, I really, really enjoyed this, and Dragon Guy, and t obviously aka Tiger Vegas, they did an extremely good job of this, it was super detailed, and really, really, really close to the gameplay of Little Nightmares. The controls were really cool, and the Roma was an awesome character, like I, actually genuinely scary when you're playing it. Um, and at the moment, it isn't really um, released to the public to play, um, but I, we managed, we were lucky enough to get special uh, privileges to play this game, but we're really glad we reached out, and they did a fantastic job. This was a really, really awesomely made fan game. So, if you have uh, the Dreams game on PS5 or PS4, you might be able to play it sometime in the future, but for now, it's just for, uh, it's just for you know, private play sessions as well. Alright, but thank you guys all for watching, we hope you enjoyed this video, if you did, please subscribe and like and comment and all that good stuff as well. Alrighty, until the next video, I'll catch you later, bye.